Alright, now we're going to talk about understitching. Understitching is when you stitch the seam allowance, okay, both sides of the seam allowance, to one side of the garment, typically a part that's going to lay on the inside, so that when it does turn at that spot, it's more likely that everything stays to the inside um, where it should be than allowing your seam to show from the outside. And it's pretty simple to do. Um, all you're going to do is you're going to press your seam allowance towards one side, towards the inside of the garment. And then we're going to stitch very close to that seam line, but we're stitching through all three layers, the two layers of the seam allowance as well as the uh, garment fabric itself. Some people call this stitching in the ditch because it's pretty close to the ditch of the uh, seam there. But I'm going to get it lined up, put my needle down. Again, I'm going to go um, a couple stitches forward before I reverse, do my back stitching, then come forward again. And again, I'm going very close to where that seam is. What I'm doing as I'm watching is I'm guiding the edge of where my, my seam was put in um, to a certain spot on my presser foot, again, so that I make sure that I'm keeping it the, an equal distance from that edge by guiding along there. And again, I'm not pushing and pulling. I am just simply guiding uh, with my fingers as the machine pulls the fabric through. And I backstitch when I get to this side. Go forward again, take my fabric out, trim my threads like always, and if you can see the edge is right here, we've just stitched it down, and now when I would go to press that to the inside, I'll even do a little finger press here so you can see, okay, that seam allowance is held to the back side of the garment. The stitching doesn't show from the outside and it's nice and kind of firm back in there. And that is what we call understitching.